Hey Virgo, this is Nikki. Welcome to the channel. I'm going to do two of these readings tonight. Uh, the alphabet readings. This is the first letter of your the first letter of your name or your uh, nickname. So we're going to get started. Spirit, what messages do you have tonight for what alphabet? Okay, we're just pulling two tonight. The first one we have is R. Okay, so we have Rachel, Richard. We have Rachel, Richard, Richard Dean, Rhonda, Rhoda, Ru Rudolph. Okay. Rotisha, Rotisha, Rita, Romero. First and last name. Let's see. What message do you have if your first initial is R? You're worried about something. Is something's bothering you? The burden is never heavy, as you may think. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, what is this going on with you? If your first initial is R, what is going on with you? Okay. Let's see. The chariot. You gotta move away from this. Whatever is bothering you, like I said, it's not as much as it's not as heavy as you think it is. It's time for you to let that go. It's time for you to drop a load. All right. Let's see what messages do I have for you if your first initial or nickname is R. You see, you're, you'll get by. You'll get over it. You know, it's not as hard as you think it was. I think this is a, the energy and it's telling you you're climbing out of this tough situation. Okay. Tough times, tough times don't last, but tough people do. Prime example. It's not, it's not, you may have a little bit, a little bit more gray hair in your head. Maybe somebody had an issue with uh, going to the hairdresser and she fucked your hair up or gave you a wrong cut or something, whatever, and you, you were mad about it. Maybe there was something that broke you out. Maybe you're allergic, alerted to something that broke you out, you know, because somebody served you and they did something wrong. Something is going on with somebody's rib area, or maybe rib cages or something. Maybe you broke your rib cage in a car accident. Sorry if that happened to you. But you're okay. Okay, everything's going to be just fine. Got the Queen of Cups. That's just here for the Virgo if your first initial is R. Got the page of wands. I think that, that you feel like you know you're alone in this situation. You probably got somebody who's really who's really catering to you, doing things for you because they love you and they care about you. This could be a, a child, maybe, or, or a younger significant other, or somebody who's younger who's really, really helping you move forward with this. And sometimes you may feel alone, but you're not, okay. Someone wants you to know that you're going to be okay. You're not alone. Um, this would be somebody who has passed away on the other side, letting you know that they are with you in your time of struggle, in your time of need. See, everything's going to be better. You know, everything's going to be okay. You just got to chill out, okay? It's, it's, it's not as hard as you think it is. It's not going to be rough for long. Because if you're looking for something, if you're looking for proof, if you're the proof, if you're looking for proof that everything's going to be okay, here you go. Y'all need to look no further, and pray, pray about it. That what that's what you can do first is pray about it. Okay, I always tell people march to the beat of my of of your march to the beat of your drum. Just listen to the beat of mine, but be open to this, to what's what's coming your way. You got to stay open for this miracle here because you are a miracle by by yourself. You know. You've had a lot of things happen to you recently, but there's an opportunity at the gate for you. But you're not seeing it because you're worried about something. Don't worry. Let it go. Okay. Whew. We got happiness. Happiness, a new start. This is for you to be happy about. You got a lot to be happy. You're looking at the big picture. All the things you've been through a year from now, Rhonda, you're going to be able to tell your story. Okay going to be able to tell your story and tell people how much you have evolved, how much you have grown, how much have has how much starting over, okay? Put you in the best place of your life, the best position of your your life to receive blessings, okay? Now, something about somebody's hair though. I don't know if maybe somebody um 
did something to their hair. It didn't turn out right. Maybe the color was all jacked up. Okay, but next year by this time, we'll have a head full of hair. Okay, no worries. Somebody's probably pregnant as well. Uh, somebody's very, very fertile. So if you don't want to have a baby, you better wrap it up. Okay. We got the judgment here. Making better decisions here. The Knight of Cups. Followed by the, the Ten of Cups. So everything is going to be happy. There are so many blessings coming your way. Whatever happened here, whatever that was burdening you and holding you down, you can wash your hands of it and drop it. Let it go. What's that saying? Let go and let God. Everything is falling into place for you very, very well. Because right now, if you let everything go, you're going to get so much more than, than you bargained for if you just let it go. <clears throat> just let it go. Because you're not looking or thinking about the big picture. And the big picture is humongous. It's humongous. You just got to open up to it and let it flow. Okay? So whatever it is that, that you're worrying about that's holding you back, I don't care if it was a fucked up hairstyle, a car accident, you know, feeling left out in the cold, maybe somebody left you, whatever the situation was, it's going to be okay. You just got to let go and let God. Right? And don't forget to pray. All right? Don't forget to pray. And if you believe in that, we'll put it that way. Okay. I hope this message resonates. If your first initial begins with R, talk to you later. And there's a playlist, Alphabet Tarot Readings, and this will be in the playlist. Talk to you later.